right, we're going to learn how to copy an individual's vocabulary. You got to the App Store and you downloaded Words for Life, and then when you hit Vocab, right here you hit Vocab, choose New Vocab, and you'll see these are all the factory vocabularies that come with the device. So you could have an individual on the one hit, the transition is the 205 words or on full, then there's a Spanish one hit and a Spanish full. So normally somebody might hit one of these, and they're in here using Think. it. And they're feeling pretty good about it, but the problem is you can't customize, hide, show, change a key's color, you know, add a word in it, because these are locked. So you have to copy it before you can use it. So you hit vocab. So, th so I'm going to go over the instructions for how to copy a vocabulary now. You hit vocab. Then you go right down here where it says choose new. Then you can see all the ones that already exist with the locked padlock. Now you go over here to the far right-hand side and you hit the one that says menu. Then you go down four buttons and you'll see one that says copy of vocabulary right here where my mouse is moving. You touch that and it says, okay, which one of these do you want to copy? So now I look through them and I want to do the one hit first right here, the very first one. Make sure you don't hit the Spanish one hit. So you hit the one hit. Now you get that chance to pick a title for it. I'm going to name mine my name. So I'm going to put in there JH one hit. And I don't worry about a description. You can put a description in right here if you want, but if you name it right, you'll know what it is. Then you touch, take your finger and touch where it says save. And now you'll see this pops up and it's kind of nice that it gives you the modified date on. So, you know, at seven o'clock, seven oh six tonight, I was doing this programming. So then you can touch that one and now you're in a file that can be modified. You might, while you're here, just hit vocab, choose new, go over here to menu again, copies the fourth one down, and then go to go ahead and copy transition. Now you touch right here where it says new title and you get to give it your description. I like calling that one two hit. It's two hits is why. It's just a, you call whatever you want. All right, just one last thing. It's kind of nice to see. And that is that you can copy an individual's vocabulary internally on their app itself. So if you hit vocab, choose new, menu again, copy a vocab again, I just want you to notice that right here, I want you to see that not only do the factory ones I'll give you the ability to copy them, but you can copy an individual's vocabulary also or a file you're using. Then you can retitle this. JH backup or something. Hit save. And then now you have the backup here and you have the JH that you started with. And again, it dates it. So that's how simple it is to back up a vocabulary.